honestly, you know, hearing a lot of the stories from these guys has just been really inspiring. Um, you know, I, I come across all kinds of different guys who are kind of, some are kind of stuck in, in a certain place in life. They're stagnant, you know, um, and they're struggling with things that are, um, very much in their control, you know, um, a lot of times when it comes to career or, um, relationships, there are a lot of things that are within our own control that we don't recognize or don't want to recognize. Mm -hmm. Um, and so, uh, you know, that's something that's always, it stood out to me for, for a number of years. Um, just recognizing in people, uh, things that they want to change, but don't actually take the steps to change, you know? Um, and so, uh, you know, a lot of the, the growth for me over the last couple of years has really been trying to acknowledge the things within myself that I want to change to get to where I want to get, get to where I want to be. Mm. Um, and, and seeing these different, um, different personalities and different experiences and hearing about different experiences as far as, you know, some guys are stagnant, like I was saying, and some guys have really done so much to improve their lives as far as business or whatever, whatever it may be. Um, you know, a lot of, a lot of people who really do the work, you know, um, and just even internationally, like guys meeting guys like you, like, um, and a lot of these other connections that I've made through Instagram, oddly enough. Yeah. um, And this community that you and I both interact with, I think pretty, pretty frequently of people who are just really doing doing what they need to do to make their dreams happen and to follow their passions, you know? Mm-hmm. Um, and so I'm constantly trying to compare, contrast those, those different mindsets and keep in mind like where, what, which mindset I want to remain in as much as possible, which is yeah. growth, right? I want to stay in that growth mindset. And so um, it's like seeing some, it's kind of like seeing somebody who has a health condition that you don't want to have, Right. It's like, okay, well, if I don't want that health condition, then I need to make sure that I eat well. I need to make, make sure that I exercise. And so you, you have that visual, like that's, that's what I don't want to be. So what do I need to do to, to stay away from that? Right. Mm-hmm. Um, and so it, it's, so a lot of times I get these examples, you know, and it, it helps me kind of keep veering toward <laughs> the, the goals that I want to, to reach. 